Hi, my name is Hayley Lynn. I am a fundraising officer here at MS Research and Relief Fund. Today we are at the opening of our very new spin classes, which we've just begun. This all came from a pedal power, which we held in January. Uh, the good thing about these classes is because of the different types of bikes we've got, all our service users and carers can take part. So it's a really important part of our exercise program that we run here at Ben Mar. We're only able to do these classes because Councillor John Bainon kindly donated us £4,500 after the success of our pedal power. So tell us a little bit about what uh, you've managed to get for your money then. So for that money we got two state of the art spin bikes and a recumbent bike. The good thing about that is it's more of a seat so if you're unstable on the spin bike but don't want to quite go on one of our motorised bikes it's kind of like a good in between. So we've got the three exercise bikes, a projector and a sound system so we've got the visual aids to go along with it as well. We also got some parallel walking bars as again just a bonus for a bit more exercise. So how important is this type of uh, fitness regime to your, uh, your users? Exercise is one of the most important things we offer. The good thing about this class is you can go at your own rate. So whilst we do have a qualified spin instructor saying you know what levels to go at, if you can't quite do that, that's fine, you can hold back. It's also one of the first classes where service users and carers can do it together. So you've kind of got that friendly motivation competition going on, which is really, really important for the sort of services we provide. So how many people uh, will use the facilities and, and how often are the classes held? So we've got classes going every Tuesday and Friday and we have a maximum of five people in the class. And without John's money, I take it, this probably wouldn't have happened? It wouldn't have happened anywhere near as soon um, and the equipment probably wouldn't have been of, uh, the standard that it is, so it's amazing the funding that we've received. Now, you're completely um, self uh, funded aren't you? Yeah that's correct, we get absolutely no NHS uh, funding, statutory funding, anything like that so we rely solely on donations, legacies, fundraising and donations from people like John. Yeah so what does this type of contribution mean to you? Like I say it means we provide a different type of exercise class so it means uh, we can constantly update our services, we are services led, there was a need for this class and because of that money we were able to provide it. Good morning, I'm Councillor John Bainan. County Councillor for Stop Hill Morpeth Division. Um, I first got involved in MS Research about a year ago when Haley asked me very kindly to, uh, which was a very hard task, to come and judge a bake-off competition. Uh, and since then I found out much more about the organisation and uh, I just really wanted to, to help more because it's such a fantastic scheme that they're doing and they help so many people. So tell us how you've managed to fund this particular project. Uh, well, all councils have a, a small allowance scheme which allows you to spend uh, a certain amount of money on, on worthwhile schemes. Um, so this I thought was a fantastic scheme, great idea, and with my help they managed to get it off the ground. They would have done anyway, but it just kind of quickened the, uh, the process. And tell us a little bit about uh, how important you think the work is that's, that's done here. Well, it's, it's fantastically important. I must have driven past here thousands of times and not realised exactly what uh, what the work that they did up here um, but when I got involved it's uh, it's fantastic uh, so much admiration for everybody who works up here. 